Alright you guys, so in today's video, I'm going to be doing an in-depth tour of this project that we have been doing. Uh, as you guys can see, there's a lot of snow, so later on, I'm going to go get the ATV and drift on this. It actually looks really nice, I haven't seen it with snow. Um, but yeah, this is what we have so far. It's looking really nice, it's going to be connecting to that mobile home, because it is an addition. We have these patio doors installed as well. So yeah, this is what we have. Um, looks really nice so far. We have been connecting the electricity over here. Obviously we have that window which we installed like a month ago. So the ridge over there is made out of a 2x10 and the rafters are a 2x8. So if you guys watched my videos in the past parts 1, 2, and 3 of this build, you guys see how uh, we put these walls up, the these kind of walls, and everything like that. So if you guys haven't seen those, go watch them. They are really entertaining. Yeah, like I said, we have electricity connected. We're still doing it though, it's not done. To these power outlets, switches, or power outlets, this is where the TV is gonna be. This is the master bedroom. This is the master bathroom. It is pretty big. The vanities are gonna be right here. The toilet is gonna be right here. And the shower. And I am also gonna be making a video of how we put up these uh, tiles in the shower and how we do the kitchen and everything like carpets, floors and everything. And we're gonna be doing this next year as well so there's gonna be more videos to come yesterday we took down this wall over here um but yeah this is where the closet is gonna be for the master bedroom this is the hallway there's gonna be a kitchen over there a door and this is where the utility utilities are gonna be such as the washer, dryer, and probably the boiler. We have some light right over there. We're also probably gonna put this window and put it over here for the bathroom. We don't want it to be too big because obviously it's a bathroom. We just want some light coming in. Um, but yeah, these, this is standing on piers. The inspector said that it's okay. As you guys can see, Said that we can do that so that's what we did because it is obviously way cheaper and we are trying to do this with the cheapest materials possible so for example these doors were only 297 dollars at home depot instead of metal we took plastic and yeah we're basically trying to do this project as cheap as possible like these windows as well there were three of these windows for 500 dollars and that doesn't mean these are all bad quality, this just means that they are less quality or we just get them at a retail price. So I'm just making this video to show some people how we are building this. Because uh, if you guys look back to the videos uh, that I've done, part 1 and 2, they got a lot of views. More views than some of my other videos. So that's why I'm making this video to show people because I feel like some people that are trying to build do watch my videos. So here it is. This is how it's connected. Um, so yeah. And here is going to be a patio. That's why we have these doors over here. 
the view isn't so nice, but uh, we do get a view outside. And maybe we can get some chairs set up for the backyard. Um, but yeah, we're also going to put lights. As you guys can see, we took down the wire over here. And we're going to put uh, three lights. One over here in the middle and one over there. And it's going to look really nice. Um, honestly, we are, I don't know, I would say maybe halfway done with this project. We have been working on this project for about a month and a half right now. But the, uh, these run pretty smooth. Obviously they have with lock. So yeah, this boiler we're probably gonna take over here. I don't know when, but definitely not today. Today we have to work on the electricity disconnecting all of these and putting them uh, placing them somewhere over here the wires so that's gonna take about two to three hours uh, we have been working at night as well so that we can you know take good use out of it so we bought this lamp right over here like $37 works really good so yeah I don't really know what else to show here, but yeah, this is basically it. I'm gonna do a little bit of a cinematics just to show you guys what we have so far.